Okay, so this is what we're going to be looking at today. This and this. So this is Microfreak firmware. And this one is Microfreak firmware with replaced wavetables. Now I'm going to show you the process of doing it. And then I'll probably cut to when it's done. But essentially you want to go to that. You want to go to upgrade. Find the file. You're going to do the custom ones. Or the replaced ones. Press OK. <clears throat> it seems to be pretty stable. I've done this four or five times. I've had no problems. If anything, I've had more problems actually opening the MIDI center than I have doing the upgrade process. But this takes a minute. So... I'll let this finish and then I'll carry on the video.